Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening to everyone in the YouTube world. I hope you guys are enjoying your day. Welcome back, and this is going to be episode two, where in the first episode, we actually explore Super Nintendo World all together. Now, this is episode two. We're going to be here for Halloween Horror Nights, which I got scared plenty of times. I hope you guys don't laugh too much at me. So Halloween Horror Nights was an amazing night there at Universal Studios Hollywood. I hope you guys enjoy the episode, so stay tuned. So let's get on with the episode. Islands of Adventure, right? Yeah. Yeah. So this is, I guess, their diagonally. Look. Okay, we have the drink called Too Late, and is there someone else right here? It's got an eyeball in it, really creepy. Okay, so we just got done with the lower lot. This is the lowest level where you're gonna find Super Nintendo World and Jurassic World and the Mummy as well. Transformers, there's a ride back there somewhere. But we had a great time. We saw what we wanted to see here. So now we're gonna work our way up, end up like at Harry Potter, Minion Land, um, some other areas. So today, just exploring Universal and um, it's been a great birthday so far so thank you like and subscribe if you're new here that's the best way to support me uh, with liking and subscribing so let's go upstairs now halloween horror nights oh my gosh we can't wait that's in like 13 hours no no 10 hours crusty land crusty land lots of restaurants and shops around okay anyways it went from really chilly in the morning to Pretty hot. Pretty, pretty hot. So you should dress for all seasons right now. Yeah, dress for all the seasons. Okay, we are back to the upper lot. We are here at the entrance of Hogsmeade. So we're gonna have such a great time. I think Hogwarts is right down there. Um, I love this area, I love Harry Potter, so we're gonna check it out. Meanwhile, at over here, you'll see a lot of Halloween Horror Nights decorations still up because it is tonight, and that's what we're doing tonight. So it's gonna be a super long day. Let's go to Hogsmeade, shall we? So that was it. Yeah, we walked over there. And then we just, yeah. Then we can have some butter beer. Three for $35 if you want a chocolate frog. Chocolate frog. That's pretty neat. And I think you get a... Um, Mix and match, a milk, dark, or white. Oh, you get a card as well. Okay. Or $14 each. Okay, should we get a butter beer ice cream? You don't have gilly weed, but you have gilly water. Yeah. Gilly water. It's actually my first time eating butterbeer ice cream, so I'm very uh, excited. That looks fun. What's the name of the place? Do you remember? We got it. Well, this is like a combination of the honeydew. There's Florian Fortescue's ice cream is here, and so and Zonko. So they like put everything together. Okay, we have the butterbeer ice cream at eight dollars and twenty nine cents before tax. It's like vanilla with butter. <laughs> <coughs> I took the ice cream. <laughs> Tastes really good, five out of five. That is crazy. Okay, so behind me, the ride is called the Flight of the Hippo Griff. It was about a 20 minute wait, about a 30 second ride at most. And I'll have to give it, I mean, it was so short that it takes a point off for me. So maybe like a three out of five. Would I do it again? Maybe for a 10 minute wait at the most. And that's pushing it. So flight of the Hippogriff. Um, see you later. I probably won't ride it again. There's a line right over there that you can use, lady. Look at donkey, look at donkey. No, 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 doing it wrong. Doing it wrong. Go hop in line like those people. Here it is, friends. Cheese! It looks so funny. It's so funny. Yeah, yeah thank you, my friends. Appreciate you, appreciate you. Thanks for stopping by. Look at donkey, look at donkey. Well, hello, buddy. Family over there. They're obviously Kung Fu fans. Look! The helmet of Master Thunder and Rhino. All right, DreamWorks Theater, it's pretty in here, actually. Yeah, it is. Don't you like it? And then these seats are gonna move, so we'll feel some movement in here. Hey, hey! I hope you can stand! Yeah, that was a, that was like a 10-minute Kung Fu Panda show. 
Um, give it a three out of five. It's something, something nice to just check out. All right, we're checking out a studio tour, right? Mm -hmm. What do they do here? Tour you around the, um, wherever they shot like movies and okay. other stuff. Interesting. So <laughs> ten movies and series, I think. Ten minute wait. Oh, that's a nice view. Studio tour, 60th anniversary. I feel so good. Here's our ride. Studios in the world today. We've even got, I'll just put this up here now, we've even got some filming going on. When this comes on on your screen in a little oh, while, wow, um, you'll know they'll be progress. filming over to your left oh, or your wow. right. Have those cameras out the ready. Have everyone. Residents. No one lives here. We've got a city, but with the only thing we can Great. do here is make movies Hannibal. and television. Beautiful and the way in which oh. we do that is we can see room services. Oh, wow. That is also for St. Dennis Medical. Again, you haven't seen it, but it is coming out on my son's birthday, November the 12th. Hey, guide, car number four, how you doing? Look how many cars are there. Yes, yes, yes. Get those 3D glasses on. We're about to go into comp. Speaking of water, we're now going to go into our, uh, well, our, uh, it's sunny here in California for about 336 days of the year. So we need to create weather somehow. Yeah. There's some actors that just said hi. Very young Dakota Fanning, the teenage actor Justin Chan. It is a real 747 oh, airplane. Oh God, Comes from the Mojave Desert where lots of planes go to retire. It was purchased for $60,000. Oh, wow. Yeah. And it cost $250,000 to bring it here to our lot. <laughs> it was actually a Paramount Pictures movie. Yeah. No, not off planet Earth. Wow. He also gave us Us and Get Out. Nope stars Daniel Kaluuya, brilliant British actor. Kiki Palmer is phenomenal in it. Stephen Yun, you might know him from uh, Beef on Netflix. It's designed by Ruth De Young. She also designed Oppenheimer, which also filmed here on the lot. Uh, can you tell me what you thought really quick? I thought it was an excellent tour. Everybody should do it. Yeah, uh, rating? Well, I guess a five out of five. <laughs> I give it you? a four out of five. Yeah. Um, very interesting, very laid back. It's a one hour just ride along. They show you where they actually shot movies. Lots of movies that I was actually surprised yeah. that were shot here. So um, I do recommend it. If you want to sit down for an hour because you've been walking all day, yes, do this. We're on our way now to go to the very entrance to pick up our wristbands for Halloween Horror Nights. So after 3, no, after 5.30 p.m., you have to have the wristband if you have purchased your Halloween Horror Night tickets. All right, what do we pick up right so now? So we just collected our wristbands for Halloween Horror Nights at the box office. Yeah. Which, hey, I don't know if we're considering getting an annual pass on this mm, one too. Oh, look, yeah. there's Scooby-Doo. Scooby-Doo hey, Scooby coming. <laughs> He's coming. See ya. He's going to take a pee break. Anyways, what did yeah. we get again? So yeah, we, yeah. we get access to the houses beginning at 7 p.m. So it's from 7 p.m. to 2 a.m. Okay, and how many haunted houses are here? I think there are nine. I think there are nine, nine haunted, haunted houses. houses. When I counted it on yeah. the app. Okay, cool. Can't be sure. Don't All hate right. on me. And uh, these, uh, the Halloween Horror Nights is 106 per person. So uh, consider it when you ever come to Universal. You can also come to Halloween Horror Nights if it's Halloween. Only on select nights. Let's watch Waterworld at 4.15, last show guys. So, for the late afternoon, here we go. All right, about to check out the Waterworld show. Super excited, are you excited, Toby? Yes. Yes, you're excited. He's <laughs> excited. Where are you going? Yeah, this is 
Okay, I think one of the best shows I've ever seen. This is called The Water World here at Universal Hollywood Studios. Um, I can't say enough, five out of five. The props were amazing, just like the plane. They use a lot of fire, a lot of fireworks, and uh, the jet skis were really cool. The stunts, the stunt people, like the, they were amazing. They were diving, they fell from like different angles. They pretend like they got shot. It was really cool effects, and it was about 20 minutes, but I can't imagine just doing all of that even for five minutes. You have to be extremely fit. They did well. There's, I mean, the props were moving, like lots of open doors, lots of um, just cool effects. So even the plane was like the best part probably. So it really shows, oh look, they're doing something up there. Oh, they're moving the cage across the ropes. So that was another thing, like a kind of like a zip line thing, but uh, really cool. Recommended five out of five. You have to watch it. Do not miss it. Halloween Horror Night is coming into effect. It is, what time is it? 4, 4 45. So, still a little early. We have like a couple hours of yeah. like eating or chilling. But um, after that, haunted houses start at 5 30. Well, we do have one at 5 30, our first one. Ooh, that looks so good. Look at these popcorn buckets. They were going for that. Oh, okay. You guys want to go first because I'm still eating. And we got a pulled pork sandwich with fries and banana barbecue sauce. So that'll be a first. And then we have the Monster Monster Bob. This was $11. Uh, this was about $18. So all together, $29. Here at Minion Cafe. Okay, so we absolutely demolished everything. So here it is. Uh, five out of five for the drink. It is really good. Cute. Uh, very cute. And uh, we almost a half of one eye so <laughs> it's edible it's candy it's actually pretty good i love this banana barbecue sauce never had anything like it They're really good and then the sandwich uh toasty melted cheese pulled pork really good so five out of five uh, the luchadores are out here look at that midget <laughs> that's fun i'm so happy we get to experience hollywood horror nights this looks familiar, doesn't it? <laughs> right here. This morning. <laughs> this morning. <laughs> now we're going back. Ten hours ago. Ten hours ago we were here. Now we're going back with this <laughs> wristband, which means we can go to the haunted house now. So, let's go. I don't think we know what we're getting ourselves into. Not really, but it's okay. So she's going to walk first and the haunted houses, and I'm going to follow her. And she's going to do a really good job because she's tough. Nothing phases her. Go first. All right, I don't know which one we're going to first, but I'm really scared, honestly. You know what? <laughs> Okay. We're from Texas. Oh yeah, right, 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 right. Okay, let's go. Okay, so another pro tip we just learned. We got the general admission for the haunted houses. We cannot enter the haunted houses until 7 p.m. And right now it's 5.39 uh, p.m. So we do not have an early access to the haunted houses. Making it complicated, we can only get in at 7. So we thought we could get in, but we'll get in here a little bit later. But they have early access. They have early access to it, which there's a lot of people going in with their early access, so that's additional money for that on top of this one here. So, just something to know. All right, let's go to Transformers first. And let's get on. 25 minute wait. Any Transformers fans, leave a comment below. So, we're gonna try this ride for the first time. Wrong. Ah! 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 What is 
Vertex, we need cover. So, Transformers, the ride 3D. I'm gonna give it a five out of five. It really had some really cool effects. Uh, again, it's a big cart with, it can fit 12 people and it moves a lot. If you are sensitive when you're watching 3D stuff, you probably might wanna avoid this as well because there's a lot of like sudden jerky movements yeah, we can and, give then it the, and the visuals are, are yeah. the same, so. Yeah. I don't know, it's not, <laughs> honestly not for me, again. I, like I really liked it, so. Again, so. I'm glad we did it. Uh, we do have time because we're not, we are not early entry. Sorry, it was a week. <laughs> we don't have early entry to uh, the haunted houses. Oh, and one last thing. I think from start to finish at the Transformers, it was about 15 minutes. So really quick, in and out. Here at Monster Eats, we're gonna go for the Fiery Bite Corn Dog. Just can't wait for that, that's $12.99. They also have other items like this cheesecake and then a nice, I think that's like a Coca-Cola, but with some gummies on it right there, so. Look at this thing, it's gotta be a foot long. Oh my gosh. Like, Probably like 10 inches, huge. I don't know. That's it's huge. huge. <laughs> that sounds wrong, but we're gonna try it. All right, let's dig in. Mm. Did you bite into the corn dog? Mm. Oh, you did, you did. Oh, that's good. Oh, that's good. It is really good, guys. Um, it's crunchy. It's got some good bread in it. And then the sausage is standard, but very delicious. I'd, I'd get it. I think it's worth it. Five out of five. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's because I'm partly Korean too. So this is my food. It's Korean uh, corn dog. All righty. Let's see. He hyped it up. So you're going to love it. I'm going to love it. He says I'm going to love it. Very good. It's huh? the breading that makes it really. Like really good. Yep, I would highly recommend the corn dog. It's a, it's a Korean style corn dog. Yeah. You know, five out of five. I give it a five yeah, out of five. Yeah. Really good. Uh huh. Very meaty too. Mm -hmm. So after this, we're gonna go to the Weekend Nightmare Trilogy Bar. That'll be fun because it's at a rooftop over here with a good view of the park. So we are on the lower lot. We are at the weekend bar. So you do have to check your ID. Well, they're gonna check your ID, give you another wristband so you can get drinks. And they're playing nothing but the weekend here. So Hollywood Horror Nights. Probably not a good idea. Maybe shop in No, we can buy them some stuff. We can buy them stuff. Okay, we have the drink called Too Late, and is there someone else right here? It's got an eyeball in it, really creepy. And this, these drinks are $18 a piece. Uh, let's dig in. So $39 for the two drinks. It's got an eyeball inside there. Here on top of the Jurassic Park Cafe, I believe. Like, here, you can plug it. Yeah, plug it. <laughs> I got the Careful. syringe. What do you have there? It's an eyeball. Look at that eyeball. Ah! Ew, she's squeezing it out. Ew, she's squeezing the blood out of it. Ew. Gross. <laughs> Happy Halloween. All right, we're going to the weekend's haunted house. Trilogy Haunted House is our very first one here at Universal Hollywood, uh, no, Horror Hollywood, 
Universal, Halloween yeah. Horror Nights. Anyway, sorry. We're yeah. gonna give it a scary rating scale. I give it a three out of five. I got us good a couple times uh, for her. It got, it got me her good too every many single time. time. You know why? Because I was the first one there. Yeah. So yeah. it's not fair. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, so, my heart. Yeah. I, I don't think I can do another one. So I do realize one thing. They, the the people kind of controlling the crowds inside the haunted house. They're kind of not like maybe too pushy, but they are like. Go, let's go, go. Let's They're go. like go 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 go. You gotta and go. And then I did realize that they don't care if you film. So if you want to get a camera out and just kind of film with your phone yeah. or a small camera, you can do that. Okay, on to our second haunted house. Which what is this called? Texas Chainsaw. Texas Chainsaw, yeah. Texas Chainsaw Massacre. So there's a 20 minute wait, and uh, mm -hmm. let's see how scary this one is. <laughs> you ready for this? Kinda not. <laughs> Still gotta do it. We paid for it. We're fine. Really I'll go first this time. Try to be side by side one another. All the way forward. Oh, it smells bad too. <laughs> Massacre is the second one that we have done. Do you think it was scarier than the first one? It was scarier than the first one. Yeah, for sure. so <laughs> I gave the other one a three out of five. This one's a four out of five. Um, yeah, it was scarier for sure. Um, um, lots of and the smells. Oh, it smelled bad. I think they, yeah. they made it really, they, I don't know, yeah. it made it like they made it really believable. Like it's in yeah. a farm. So yeah. the smells Very, uh, that bloody. they induce, yeah. Yeah. And oh, God. Lots it's... of meat and dead people and blood. And, and this gore. It's yeah, very gory. Yeah, very gory. Mm -hmm. Ugh, smelly, so, gory, scary. Texas Chainsaw Massacre, really good job. I if you want to get scared. Yeah. Okay, we're going to ride the Eternal Bloodlines is the next haunted house. 10 minutes. And by the way, like and subscribe if you're loving these videos. And uh, that's the best way to support the channel. So happy Halloween to everyone. Hope you guys are enjoying your weekend, your Halloween, everything going on in your life. So let's get to it. You scared me.
of blood banks. <laughs> we literally piggybacked another family, yeah. like close to them. You have so to like be on their back so that, so that you, you don't, don't get too scared. <laughs> oh, so stupid. Um, I give it a like a three out of five. Yeah, I wasn't as scared as the, as yeah. Texas Chainsaw. So yeah. Okay, over here at the lower lot of Universal Studios you'll find four haunted houses. We've done three of them so far. Now I think we're gonna make our way back up to the upper lot and uh, start doing the haunted houses over there. There'll be a lot of maps like this. It tells you what's in the lower lot. There it is. All right, let's go. Are you scared? Scary cat, scary cat. No. All right, I'm a little scared, but hey, we're gonna do this. Oh, we're gonna get off. Such a target. You're a target. Oh, I don't yeah, know. You just look too little and cute. God damn it! Oh my God, what's wrong with her? They're all like follow me. I know. You're just chilling there. No, watch out, watch out. Ah! You have to look forward. <laughs> where do I look? I need to look up. No, he's not gonna come out. Watch out to your left. Watch out your left. Watch out your right. Spell the turks in the You're safe. Awesome. We're gonna chill out, relax, and back off home as we take you back to the theme park to endure the rest of Halloween Horror Nights. Okay, we just did the Terror Tram, which was a feature with the Blumhouse and a lot of movies within that. So we did a like a walk around outside, uh, just a lot of characters just scaring us. I'll give it a two out of five in the scaring scale. It wasn't too bad. It was just really cool, and uh, again, it was outdoors. So it, you weren't encased like you usually are in a haunted house. 
So I would do it again though. I give it like a five out of five experience, but in a scary level, I give it a two out of five. So for the terror tram, I really like the part where, my favorite part honestly was when we got out of the tram into the Blumhouse and all of the scary like people were out, Megan and I don't know the others, <laughs> but they, it's like they had like a welcoming party. That was fun and it was chaotic, so it was fun. It's a late night with Chucky. Should so, 40-minute night. I mean, 40-minute wait. Oh, it might be at that theater again. Yeah. The one it for is. Uh, Kung Fu Panda. It is a <laughs> 29 inches. Okay, turn it here. Check his height. 29 inches. Oh, wait, height? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Also 29 inches. <laughs> Even when I'm laying down. Yeah, you, gotta, you gotta calm down there, big boy. It does it in well. And it's well for me. Thank you, Dum Dums. It's been a pleasure talking about me. Be sure and watch Chucky. Stream it now on Peacock. I'm sorry, is this whole thing just been a promo? Damn right it is. This has been Late Night with Chucky. Sign it off. Okay, we just watched a Late Night with Chucky. Uh, it was about a 30 minute wait and then a, maybe like a 10 minute show. Uh, was it worth it? Absolutely not. It was a one out of five. Um, Chucky was just behind the desk, just a lot of talking, answering questions, and like he didn't, I don't know, it wasn't like what I thought it was gonna be. It was like comedy, it wasn't scary. Look, 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 watch out. <laughs> oh, <laughs> This is so cool. Oh, oh my. Oh, you got me good. Okay, what do we got tonight? We're gonna do the Monstros 2, the Nightmares of Latin America. So, it's a 25 minute wait.
Probably has to be one of the best ones, maybe. Probably because it's like it. The highest it went was like 110 minutes. I oh think, my god! When no. I was looking at it, right now it's like wasn't an it 130? No, never mind. Yeah, 130. 130. Yeah. And then right now I think it's an 80 minute wait. Give me some of that gilly weed. I need some gilly weed right now because I'm so freaking tired. It's been a long day. This is one of the longest days ever at a theme park. Okay, well, what's the name of the restaurant and what did we get? So this is the three broomsticks. We are currently in um, Harry Hogsmeade. Potter. Hogsmeade. Hogsmeade, yeah. <laughs> yeah, um, and we got some spare ribs with some corn. It's a lot of food. It's a lot of food, actually. Yeah. So um, cost $28.45. $28.45. 45 cents for all of this. So I think, honestly, I think you, you can share. You can you split can this, this with yeah. somebody. Because yeah. it's huge, it's huge. And they got a lot of potatoes too. Lots of ribs. Potatoes. So, potatoes, ribs, and corn. corn the, the whole so. corn. So, All right. let's see how let's we like it. it. It looks good. Okay, what are you giving it? What's the corn? Mm, I got. I'm actually giving this meal a 5 out of 5. I really like it. The three room six. I give it a 4 out of 5. It's pretty good. I would come back to it. My favorite part is gonna be that chocolate right there that's looking at me in the face. <laughs> he hasn't even tasted it, but he already knew because that was gonna know. be his favorite part. Yeah. <laughs> oh, La Llorona. Yeah, she La wants Llorona. kids. That's why she's looking for kids. Yeah. La Llorona, La Llorona. The Chainsaw Fox. What's up, guys? <laughs> what is he doing? Oh my god. Oh. Watch out, watch out, one boy. You can hear it. See what he did? All right, so guys, uh, Universal Studios Hollywood was a complete success for being the first time that we've been here. And then we ended it with Halloween Horror Nights and it's almost midnight. So it was literally a 16 hour day. That's crazy, I'm almost dead. I have to go to sleep like really soon or I'm just gonna pass out, I feel like. But uh, yeah, no, we ate everything here that we could. Uh, we tried all the rides that we could. Nintendo World was my favorite part. You guys already know, you guys have seen the footage. So let me know in the comments if you've been here or if you haven't. Uh, Nintendo World again, the best part of my day. And a great birthday overall, so I loved it. And uh, we're gonna say bye to Universal Studios for today because tomorrow we are coming back. Just for a little bit after we have to go home. So um, again, I can't thank you guys enough. Like and subscribe and uh, let's go on and go home. I love our uh, hotel's Halloween decor. Yeah. So they have a lot of Halloween decorations around. They got spiders and that's really nice. 
Well guys, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening to everyone in the YouTube world. We are here and it is 12.15 uh, Sunday. So, complete 16 and a half hours back here at the hotel. We are so done. I'm just gonna shower and literally lay down. And uh, we'll figure out tomorrow, tomorrow, or today. I guess today is today already. So, okay. Well, guys, catch you in the morning. We'll see y'all. Yeah, it's gotta be open. Here's a Power Up Cafe. I'm super, super excited. Where is Mario and Luigi? It says 12.30. Oh, man. They're supposed to be right here taking photos with people. Anybody likes Hello Kitty? Oh, she's a bat. Oh, a bat. 